I don't believe in collective punishment. I deal with you as an individual. Individual. Therefore, white privilege is a lie. I have asked you very simply to show me the white person that has privilege over me. Nobody stood up. Do you think you have privilege over me? Yes. You're crazy. You're insane. You have no privilege over me. Let's make this absolutely positively clear. You have no privilege over me. And if you got it, show it to me right now. What's up, YouTube? Hope you guys are feeling good. Today, guys, we're back on a new video. Today, we're going to check it out. Black conservative debates leftists on white privilege. Okay? Let's give this video a try, guys. Poof. Hi. I would like to preface my question with a couple of words from a fellow American and a fellow Christian myself. So I would just... I would like to open with a verse from Leviticus 19, verse 15. It says, You shall not do injustice in court. You shall not be partial to the poor or defer to the great, but in righteousness shall you judge your neighbor. And that, to me, relates to the institution of white privilege and what the liberal liberalists claim that it is. It is not to put white people above. It is not to bring black people down. It is to judge what wrong has been done in the past by white people so we can learn from our mistakes and move forward in this country. <laughs> and so I am going to be blunt since you were advocating for violence, such as your example with hanging and Muhammad Ali. I just want to know what is the point in spreading blatant lies as, um, nice. as, We've heard to before, such as like the liberals were taking over the government to elect black or like liberals in mass. I mean, if you look at our Congress today, it is seventy percent white. I just, I just want to know why. Well, that's not a lie because if you look at the black community, which is what I'm talking about, um, almost one hundred percent of our representation are liberal. Hmm. When you go to any city, any majority black district, um, the person that represents that area is a liberal. So when you're talking about a lie, you obviously don't know what you're talking about because that's a fact. It's not a lie. Um, also, when you start talking about what white people have done to America, it's about what a white person has done. I don't believe in collective punishment. Um, I'll make you responsible for what you did. I'm not going to hold, hold you responsible for what somebody else did 100 years ago or what somebody else did today. True. I hold you responsible for your action. You hold me responsible for my action in the same way that uh, some white people believe the black people are lazy, shiftless, and ignorant and whatnot. That's not me. In the same way that most of y'all believe I'm on, they're on their knees begging and slobbering and asking for reparations, that's not me. I don't believe in collective punishment. I deal with you as an individual. Individual. Therefore, white privilege is a lie. I have asked you very simply to show me the white person that has privilege over me. Nobody stood up. Do you think you have privilege over me? Yes. You're crazy. What? You're insane. <laughs> You have no privilege over me. Let's make this absolutely positively clear. You have no privilege over me, and if you got it, show it to me right now. Thank you. Um, my parents had generational you said wealth. You, what's your privilege over me? Exactly. <laughs> well, you tell me. Ooh, let her speak. Let her speak. Yeah, we listen to you the whole time. Yeah, let her speak. Come on. Shut up, boy. She's speaking. Shut up, boy. My parents. <laughs> were able to own a house prior to 1960. Their parents were able to own a be banking account. They were able to go directly to a bank. They were able to own a house. They were able to get a job. And all of that wealth accumulated through the generations onto my generation. So that is why and I was able to. Finished. Yes. You're crazy. Very crazy. You're insane. I like this man. Yeah, that's crazy. You don't have any privilege over me. Speak, speak, speak. Who are you? Yeah. Sorry, you said this question. Speak. Go ahead. Yeah. Uh, I think you misunderstood me. Um, I told you that I did not believe in white privilege as a punishment. I just meant it as an acknowledgement as what crimes have done in the past. And then you came and attacked me for that. You are misconstruing what I am saying actively. It is not that I believe I'm better than you. 
or that you are worse than me. I am not trying to punish anybody. I am acknowledging the system that exists. Is she crying? Uh, was, was there a question in that? I was responding to your statement that was untrue. Which was? You said you mentioned something about collective punishment. Yeah. I said nothing of the sort. Okay, you're saying that your grandparents had privilege over me? They had privilege over yours. No, they didn't. Thank you. You didn't know what? my parents. You didn't know my people, so you don't know that. There was a whole, there was a whole lot of people that were there. But right now, I'm talking about today. You See, again, listen, 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 listen. Hold it. Wait, 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 wait. Listen, listen. I'm done. To what end is this to make white people do what? I mean, what is the, what is the end game of this? To do what? To make white people say they have privilege and to what end? I mean, what do you want? Thank you. Oh, I'm asking you, what do you want? What do you, what's the end game here? I'm saying that I don't think we understand the difference between privilege and supremacy. That is not what we're talking about. But what white privilege is, is Don't lecture me, young man. Well, I would love to watch the entire clip of this. Like, towards end, it's as simple as that. Okay, towards end to say that the white privilege exists, like towards end. The funny thing is that it does not exist. <laughs> it literally does not exist. Charlie have said this countless times. Can is always have said this countless times, guys. I like this man. I'm going to check more of his videos because he spill out the facts. A lot of people are hiding. There is no kind of thing as white privilege, guys. Prove it. It's simple as that. Prove it. Why? Prove it. Believe you are. You have privilege over me. Just tell me. In this dispensation we are in now, tell me. There is no proof to that. What is just got to me pissed right here is that she was crying. Why was she crying? Why was she getting emotional? Is it that she feel like um, what she's saying literally doesn't make any sense or the man's expression was very harsh to... He was just saying the, the truth. She said she has privilege over the man. The man said you are crazy for saying that because it's totally true. How will you say you have privilege over him? Because what, you're white? Is there a job you can get that he cannot get? Is there a rank you can achieve that he cannot achieve? Even the highest rank in America has been the president. Barack Obama, who is a black man, I've obtained it. It's, it's a plain truth that there is no height that a white person can get that a, a black man cannot achieve. It's literally the same in our dispensation. You can't carry the thoughts of your 4445. I keep on saying this literally in all my videos that concern white privilege. You can carry the, the issues of centuries ago to bring it to our current living. You, once you carry the past to recent, it will mess things up. There is no one who owns a slave that is still alive in during those times. So, who are you going to fight against now? Who are you going to banter with? You can't... Black people can't keep hiding under that and say that the whites have done this, why did they have done that? The whites currently who are living in America now literally have done nothing wrong. It's just that four, 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 four fathers, what history have spoken. You can't now be angry with them. You want reparation. To what end do you want the reparation? To what end will this white privilege be like, it is done. We are done with this. There's no more white privilege. There's no more issues now with um, black and white. We are all the same now. When, to what end will this white privilege be over? There is no end. According to her statement, she said she's just making an acknowledgement. That was not an acknowledgement. She was telling the man in his front that she's better than him. In what way are you better than him? In what way? 
now she said her four, 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 four father, so her father, her grandfather, is better than him. In what way? It's it's crazy how people think. Like it's very very crazy. Like I love this man's speech. Like he gets me. I'm having goosebumps. It gives me goosebumps right here. Like I'm feeling the, the ginger. I love how he's raw. He does not hide his statement. He's, he said it out plain straight. This is amazing, guys. I'm going to check him out more. So, guys, comment down below. Think about this video. Give us a thumbs up. Share this video to as many as can. Subscribe to our channel, guys. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure you stay safe.